Hello, I'm Eric Runquist. I am the butterfly conservation biologist here at the Minnesota Zoo. Dakota skippers are a U.S. threatened species and we've been now breeding them for the last couple of years. The world's first program like that. The mission of the Minnesota Zoo is to connect people, animals, and the natural world to save wildlife. And that's really what this behind the scenes program is all about. We are trying to save some of Minnesota's prairie butterflies. Prairies are the most endangered ecosystem in North America. Only 1% of it is left. And with that disappearance of the prairie, we've also lost a huge amount of the natural wildlife from those prairies. And that includes a lot of butterfly species. For example, the Dakota skipper used to be one of the most common butterflies on the prairies of Minnesota. And it is now only found in maybe one or two spots in the state. And so working with a bunch of different partners, We've been now establishing the world's only breeding population for Dakota skippers. And those are gonna be used as the plan goes for a reintroduction of them into some prairies in the Minnesota or the upper Midwest in the next couple of years. We're really writing the book on how to do this as we go. So beyond what we're doing here at the Minnesota Zoo behind the scenes, you can help out butterflies and pollinators in your own backyard as well. Feel free to swing by any of the guest services desks or through the Abeta Butterfly Garden this year and pick up our two pamphlets that we've developed that talk about how to plant for pollinators and understand the kinds of great native plants you can be planting in your own yard to help out native pollinators. You can also find this online. As well as our get to know your butterflies in the backyard. There's a lot going on in just your backyard, so we encourage you to to understand and just explore what's going on around you. That's the best way you can be helping.